Hello from Supermom's Kitchen. Today's recipe is Pau Bhaji. You're going to take one cup of green peas, one cup of cauliflower follets, one cup of da uh, cut it into cubes carrot, one cup of beans, fresh beans. Now, and uh, you're going to and two large potatoes. See, cut it into small cubes. And we're going to cook all these in a pressure cooker with half a cup of water and salt. Just boil it with just one whistle would do and all will be cooked. So I repeat, carrot, potato, green peas, beans, see, green peas, potato, carrot, beans and cauliflower. Next we're going to have one tablespoon of ginger garlic paste, half a tablespoon of chili powder, quarter teaspoon of turmeric, green chilies finely chopped, one onion chopped finely and we're going to have pow bhaji masala and you're going to take half a teaspoon of pow bhaji masala and half a teaspoon of garam masala w two tomatoes for garnishing a bunch of coriander leaves we have quarter cup of capsicum and this is also for garnishing finely chopped two onions lemon juice and we have either you can have a, a pow bhaji buns see or you have the small bun or the big bun now let's pour some oil in a pan splatter a little cumin uh, this is a quarter a quarter slice of the lemon and take the juice out of it and keep it aside now we have the cumin splutter the cumin once you splutter the cumin just drop in the onions the green chili then the ginger garlic paste see that you remember you should boil all this and mash it up we're going to have one tablespoon of butter You can either use the burger buns or the pow bhaji buns. Just slice it into half like this. Now I've dropped in the onions and the green chili. Saute it for some time till it's translucent. Now let's slicely mash up the boiled vegetables and the potato slightly not too much now i'm going to drop in the ginger garlic paste stir it till the raw flavor is off from the onions So now it's done, we're going to drop in the dry ingredients, the chili powder, turmeric powder and the pow bhaji masala and the garam masala. Stir it for 2 minutes and once this is done, we'll drop in the capsicum and then next after that the tomatoes. You don't need to saute this for some for too long. Well, now that's done, we'll drop in the tomato. Now I've dropped in the tomatoes. So that you stir it really well so all the tomatoes are really cooked well.
Now let's pour in the lemon juice. That's a quarter part of the one lemon. Stir it well. Well, this is done. Let's now drop in all the mashed vegetables. If you have the drained water from the vegetables, you can pour it now at this moment and let it all get evaporated and get have a thick budgie. Check for salt. Have to serve it very hot while it's hot. This is done. I'll drop in a tablespoon of butter. We're going to put some lemon juice into the onions for garnishing and a pinch of salt. Make a kadai. Place little butter, spread little butter, and then we're going to put in the the bun. Turn it on both sides and see that it's a little brown. On both sides. We have put the pow bhaji and it's ready to serve. We have topped it with the onions with uh, lemon juice and the coriander leaves. And there we have the uh, toasted bun in butter. Hope you enjoy this new recipe. Pow bhaji. It's an Indian dish from South Kerala. Thank you for watching my video. I'll be back soon with another new recipe. Bye from Supermom's Kitchen.